Hello friends subscribe technology and press the bell icon to never miss the updates. Hey guys welcome back to our channel technology. So today in this video I'm going to show you guys 20 most essential software for your windows computer. So you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe our channel technology. So without wasting any more time let's start the video. Number 1 is Thunderbird email client software for windows. This email client is free open source with many features which is help you to access your mail faster. This mail client is support on the different type of platform like Linux or Windows. Number 2 is Folder Lock app for Windows. Basically this software will help you to make password protected folders. With this software you can do lock your folders, encrypt your data or files, backup your drives, protect your USB and lots more. Number 3 is AIMP Audio Player. This software is freely available on the internet for Windows and Android both. If you want to play MP3 songs on your Windows computer then this software will help you to play smoothly your audio songs. Number 4 is Neonite Package Management System for Windows. This software is allows user to install multiple software in one click. So just go to Neonite official website after that select your software from the list and after that click on get your Neonite. Number 5 is Oslogix Dix Defrag Free. It's the most popular and highest rated defrag mission tool for your windows. Number 6 is Test Disk. It is the most powerful free software for windows to recover your data. With this software you can do fix partition table, recover delete partition, fix fat tables, recover fat32 boot sector and lots more. Number 7 is Spot Player app for Windows. It is a video playing third party software for your windows computer. This software is support 32 bit and 64 bit both the architecture version. Number 8 is 7zip. This software is almost works like WinRAR. Through this software you can extract or encrypt your files, folders or documents. Number 9 is LibreOffice. This is the open source office suite. This software is available for Mac, Linux and Windows platform. So if you don't have that much of money to buy MS Office then you can try this LibreOffice on your computer. Number 10 is AnyBurn. It is a free source software which is freely available on the internet. Through this software you can burn CD, DVD or Blu-ray discs. The next one is iObit Uninstaller. To download this software freely you have to go to this website it's called www.iobit.com. So I will give you this link to my video description. So after I go to this website you have to click on this free download button. After that you have to click on install and now click on yes I agree. Now click on install. Now as you can see it's installing on my computer so you have to wait for a few minutes. Now click on no thanks and after that click on finish. So now if you want to uninstall any program from your computer then just select that program from here and after that click on uninstall. And after that click on uninstall again. Number 11 is Rufus. This software is used to create a bootable USB pen drive. You can try this software to make a bootable Windows pen drive or bootable Linux pen drive. Number 12 is Typing Master. This software will help you to speed up your typing speed. So if you have a slow typing speed then this software is for you. The next one is CCleaner. This is the most popular and best cleaning apps for Windows. With this software you can make your computer faster than before. Also you can use this software to fix your registry and clean your junk or temp files. 
The next one is Avira antivirus for free. So if you don't have that much of money to buy a paid version of antivirus, then you can try this antivirus on your Windows PC. So for that you need to go to this avira.com website. So I will give you this link on my video description. So after go to this website, you have to click on this free download. So now it will download on your computer as you can see. So now you have to install on your computer. The next software is Recover. This software is help you to recover your delete files from your computer quickly and easily. So to download the software on your computer, you have to go to this website, it's called ccleaner.com slash recover. Also I will give you this link to my video description. After go to this website, you have to click on this download free version and now click on this free download. And after that click on this ccleaner.com. Now it will directly download on your computer. After that you have to install this recover on your computer. And now click on install. So now as you can see the installation is successfully completed on my computer. Now click on run recover. And after that click on next. Now here I need to choose which type of file you want to recover. In my case I will choose a document or you can choose picture, music, whatever you want. After that click on next. And now you have to select your location from where you need to uh, recover your deleted files. After that you have to click on next. Now click on start. The next one is VirtualBox. Through this software you can run any operating system on your computer virtually. To download this software you have to go to this virtualbox.org website and after that click on this download box, download virtualbox option. And after that you have to click on this windows host. And now as you can see the download has been started. So after download if you want to add any operating system over there then you have to click on this new button and after that you have to type over there any operating system name like in my case I will put here Windows uh, 10 and after that click on next and then you have to select the memory how much memory you want to spend with this virtual uh, virtual machine and after that click on next then create then next then click on next then create again once again and after that click on uh, start button over there the next one is prism video converter through this software you can easily convert your videos on avi mp4 wmv mov and lots more to download this software you have to go to this website so i will give you this link to my video description and after I go to this website you have to click on this download prism avi video converter and after that it will download automatically on, on your computer so after download and install this software on your computer, you have to open Prism Video Converter on your computer. Now click on add a files and after that select your videos. So now if you have to convert your videos on MP4 format, then you have to click on these output format and select the MP4 from the drop down list and after that click on convert. The next one is Adobe Reader. Through this software you can view any PDF file on your computer. To download this Adobe Reader on your computer, you have to go to this website. It's called gate.adobe.reader slash reader. And after go to this website, you have to uncheck these three options over there. The number one is install Adobe Reader Google Chrome extension. And this one is McAfee security and McAfee safe connect. After that, you have to click on install now button. Now as you can see it's initializing, so you have to wait. So now as you can see one file is automatically downloaded on my computer, so you have to click on open. And after that click on yes. So now as you can see Adobe Reader is downloading on my computer. So I have to wait for a few seconds maybe. The last one is free download manager. This software is help you to download any files from the internet using URL. So this software support Windows and Mac both the version. To download the software you have to go to this free download manager.org website and after that click on this free download button.
I hope this video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button, like button and share button and if you have any queries or question then comments down below. Also don't forget to check out my latest videos on my channel. Just go to youtube.com slash technology and you will get all my videos over there. So I will see you guys in the next one next video. Take care.